morning traders, George Troop here. European markets have just opened pretty flat start to the day, as has been the way for the last couple of weeks, really. Um, definitely a sense of markets monitoring developments in Ukraine constantly. Uh, and today assessing the IMF's latest global economic forecast. Um, so yes, as you can see, FTSE down a little bit today. It has been building up ground sort of cautiously um, since the invasion in Ukraine. Uh, as you can see from this chart, almost back um, to where it was back in mid-February. Um, so yeah, above the 7,610 mark today. Um, DAX slightly up, a few sort of cautiously positive days. Um, similarly, not quite as strong a rebound as the FTSE has shown, um, but definitely keeping an eye on things. Um, we have, of course, had earnings season, some European uh, big ones out recently. Credit Suisse, um, I can't find the chart, but its shares are down 2.5%. Um, after the Swiss bank said it expects a loss in reported first quarter earnings after increasing legal provisions. Uh, Heineken, let's have a look there. You can see a nice jump there. Their shares are up about 3% um, after the world's largest brewer reported higher than expected beer sales in the first quarter. Um, definitely a sense of um, everything keeping an eye on Ukraine still. Uh, Eastern Donbass region, there has been a Russian offensive. Um, top official describing it as the second phase of the war. Um, so definitely markets a bit jittery still. Um, you can see here, Euro dollar up a little bit today, above 1.08 um, after it's been continuing its downward run of late. Uh, we do, of course, also have um, IMF news yesterday cut its global growth projections for 2022 and 2023, citing the economic impact from Russia's invasion. Um, they had also, the World Bank had also lowered its global growth forecast uh, back on Monday by nearly a full percentage point, uh, down to 3.2%, also citing pressure. So growth forecasts very much down. Uh, commodities, quick check. Gold down this week uh, after some gains last week with that inflation data. Uh, oil back up a little bit today, but had a pretty uh, serious dip yesterday. Uh, of course, very choppy on all the supply chain, uh, supply and demand issues. The Russian raising Russian gas, exactly. Uh, natural gas also dipped yesterday, uh, as you can see there. And finally, let's just have a quick check on crypto. Had a couple of positive days, uh, down slightly today. Bitcoin price, 41395 uh, That's it from me. I'll be back this afternoon.